Hilton Head Island is an oasis of sunshine, outdoor activities, and incredible nature. So it's no surprise that over 3 million people descend upon the town each summer. Everyone comes for their own individual reasons, but they all stay for what's easily the best fishing in South Carolina. In this video, we'll tell you all about the incredible species you can catch while fishing in Hilton Head, where and how to hook them, and show you that angling here doesn't only have to be a summer sport. You'll also get to hear from local captains, check out some of our anglers' catches, and learn a few important rules and regulations to keep your trip running smoothly. There's plenty to cover, so let's get right into it. Every town has a signature fish, and in Hilton Head, it's hard to single out just one. We have to start this video somewhere though, so redfish seems like a good place. They're known locally as spot tail bass, and in Hilton Head's inshore waters, they grow big, fight hard, and taste great. Catch them while they're small and you've got yourself a puppy. On the other hand, fish reaching over 30 inches are called bulls. You can find bull reds in the fall and winter months, whereas puppies, which make for the best eating, can be found year round. While you're fishing for this species, you'll also have speckled trout and flounder fighting for your bait. If you're looking for a delicious inshore meal, we guarantee you'll be happy hooking into any of these three. If you're after sport fishing royalty, set your sights on tarpon. Nicknamed the Silver King, these prehistoric fish show up on all fronts. Most anglers use heavier tackle when fishing for hard-fighting tarpon, but those looking for a true challenge attempt to hook them on the fly. For your best shot, visit Hilton Head during the height of summer. Tarpon will start to roll in in May and usually stick around until early September. Next up on notable fish is cobia. Despite what you might think, these fish taste great and fight hard, making them a firm favorite among Hilton Head anglers. Their run starts in May and they'll stick around for a full three months before they migrate south towards warmer waters. And while you're out there searching for cobia, you're very likely to come across some sharks. In fact, there are so many shark varieties on Hilton Head's doorstep that heading out and fishing for them is the closest you'll come to a guaranteed catch. They vary vastly in size and habitat, but each and every one of them puts up an excellent fight. Cast for black tip, bonnet head, and bull sharks closer to shore, or get your hands on some real monsters out in the depths of the Atlantic. You'll have your best shot at a battle in the summer months and during the early fall. As you move further from shore, there's more to look forward to. First on that list is red snapper. While there aren't as many of these fish in South Carolina's Atlantic facing waters as there are in the Gulf of Mexico, there's still usually a short open season in the summer months, which can see you go home with some table fare. While you're out there, you can also take the opportunity to target grouper, triggerfish, and black sea bass, making a day of bottom fishing a very worthwhile experience. And if you're feeling really bold, hop on an extended full day fishing charter and have your captain take you up to 100 miles offshore to fish the Gulf Stream where you could encounter billfish, tuna, and mahi-mahi. I'll tell you one of the things that's the most common fish we target here in Hilton Head is a variety of sharks, actually. The sharks are great sport. This area is one of the largest shark breeding grounds in the east coast of the United States. We've got a lot of protected waters, and since sharks give birth to live babies, they've learned since the prehistoric times to uh, come on in here and have their babies where the uh, predator fish aren't so thick. Um, so we do a ton of shark fishing here. Everything from one foot long little guys to 14, 15 foot tiger sharks. All right, so now that you've figured out which fish you can catch, you're probably wondering where you should go. Hilton Head is an island, so aside from being surrounded by water on all sides, it also boasts 12 miles of pristine beaches, piers, and of course, plenty of marinas stocked with charter boats ready to take you out for a taste of Hilton Head's favorite pastime. For inshore species like redfish, tarpon, and speckled trout, exploring Hilton Head's shallow sounds and lagoons is an excellent place to start. The Calabogie Sound, an area of deep water at the toe of the island, is a great spot for bull reds and speckled trout closer to shore and tarpon and cobia further out. The lagoon systems within palmetto dunes and sea pines also offer up opportunities to target similar fish, all while taking in picturesque landscapes. The great thing about inshore fishing in Hilton Head is that even short trips lasting between two and three hours can be very productive. But if you're looking for something more adventurous, hopping aboard a charter boat and heading deep is the way to go. Roughly 18 miles from shore, you'll come across Betsy Ross Reef. It's the largest artificial reef in South Carolina and one of the best places to target some of those bottom fish we mentioned earlier, including black sea bass and red snapper. Deep sea fishing charters heading at least 70 miles out to reach the Gulf Stream run out of Hilton Head year round, but the spring and summer months are your best bet for a shot at landing billfish, mahi, and more. While we're on the topic of charter fishing, hopping on a boat is the easiest way to ensure you'll catch fish in Hilton Head. 
First and foremost, you'll have an experienced local captain on board who will be able to tailor and guide the trip based on your skill level and goals for the day. It doesn't matter if you're a beginner or a seasoned pro. Having a local with you who knows the waters inside and out is an invaluable asset. Your captain will also take care of your fishing gear in most cases and offer a range of equipment to help put you on fish. Bring your friends and family, split the cost, and spend a day in Hilton Head in the best way possible, out on the water. If charter fishing isn't on the cards for you, don't worry, you can still get in on the action. Hilton Head is famous for its beaches, so surf fishing is a no-brainer here. You can also try wade fishing or head to one of the local piers for a little more variety. Depending on the season, you can come across anything from redfish and bluefish to sheep's head and flounder. The only species you can't target are sharks, since shark fishing from shore is illegal on the island. Finally, to cover a little more ground, consider kayak fishing. Launch from the beach and head out into the bays and sounds to reel in a variety of fish from redfish to cobia. It may look easy, but kayak fishing requires a heck of a lot of physical stamina. If you're new to the sport, head out with a friend and a radio to stay on the safe side. There are just a few more things to cover before you're ready to get out on the water. The first is fishing licenses. Everyone over the age of 16 needs to have a valid fishing license to fish in Hilton Head. There are a few exceptions though, including when you're fishing aboard a charter with a licensed captain. In these cases, your captain will cover them for you. For more information on fishing licenses, including the different types available and their prices, check out our extensive blog article linked in the description below. As we've already mentioned, it's illegal to target sharks from shore, and it's important to note that fish like red snapper are subject to seasonal closures that can differ from year to year. It's always a good idea to read up on the latest changes on South Carolina's DNR website and check in with your captain before heading out. By now, you're surely ready to hit the waters or the beach. To book the fishing charter that's right for you and the trip you're planning, download the Fishing Booker app. It's available on Google Play and the App Store and allows you to browse the largest selection of fishing charters, compare prices and amenities, and book fast and easy. Or check us out online at fishingbooker.com and start planning your Hilton Head fishing trip today.